What is up, Peace TV HD here, and I'd like to welcome you to a brand new CSGO video. Now, uh, just before I get into this video, I'd like to say, I know I haven't been uploading as recently, as regularly, actually, as I have been uh, these past few weeks, uh, but I am... Uh, back to it. I was busy, so I do apologize for that, but then there's going to be a lot more videos, a lot more new ideas coming up, so I hope you enjoy what's coming for the future. But anyway, let's get into this video. Uh, this video is actually analyzing... I'll actually be analyzing one game. Uh, I'll be looking at highlights of my game, and it's called, it's called like a self-analysis on CSGO to kind of help me improve on situations and things that may happen in CSGO that uh, I probably could better myself for. So... You, I think, I hope that makes sense. Uh, so it's kind of, as I said, a self-analysis to kind of make myself a lot better and understandable as how I should act in situations that maybe I didn't act so well. So we're going to go straight into We're going to watch highlights instead of watching the whole demo. Um, if you want to know how you can do this, you just go to like watch on your CSGO game, your your games, download it, and then you can just do straight from there. So uh, we're going to get into this uh, game, see how I've done. I think I've got 26 to 20. Uh, here I am. They will fast forward until your highlight uh, arrives. Don't know how I died there. So I, I decided to grab the op here and See, I, I do personally think I could have done better there trying the flick shot. I uh, did come back Did end up getting the kill, but you know, I probably could do better. Maybe I should be more aware of my surroundings in these in this time Oh, actually that was okay. I quite, I'm quite, I quite like that. Uh, I feel like Actually, given that this is actually the warm-up, I sound like an absolute idiot, don't I? <laughs> Great start, Sean. It is the warm-up, and you're already analysing. <laughs> okay, so here comes the game. Wait, this is... Oh, it's 3-0 it's, it's already. Bloody hell. It's just... I didn't get a kill in three rounds. Oh, the spray. It did work, but... I mean, it's... Oh, okay. I think that's how I died. Taking a peek. I shouldn't have taken a peek there. Maybe my actually will go down. But, um, just let you know, I'm kind of winging this. I haven't got any script or anything worked out here. Uh, I think that was the right move for me. I'm not too sure. The situation does depend on who sees you first. But when you've got two people coming up, I personally think it's better to go for the person shooting you first or who you see first. Uh, instead of just shooting the first one you see. Because maybe there's someone there who's already seen you, start shooting at you. You've got to defend yourself rather than just be always offensive. You know, even though it's called global offensive. Haha, <laughs> funny joke right there. Anyway, so we are here. And that accuracy is a little poor. I do personally believe that I need to kind of uh, turn down my sensitivity. Uh, I did look up a few things, as you can see here. Absolutely ridiculous accuracy. I did end up getting the kill. Um, oh, that was the last one as well. Quite nice. Um, yeah, I did. I did realise that uh, my sensitivity is quite high. I heard that pros usually go from like 1.8 to 3, and I've got mine on like 4, which is considered really high. So I, I might turn that down. Uh, it does depend, but. I think so because my, my crosshair keeps jumping so it makes it really hard for me to kill people in range and do long distance stuff. A very lucky shot though I feel. Um, I don't know if you guys knew this. I think you do. If, you, if you've been playing CSGO for a long time you probably are aware of it that you can shoot through that thing near the bench. Someone's camping behind it. How did I not see those footsteps? Just to the right there was footsteps. He comes down and he kills me as well. How did I not see the footsteps? Literally just up the steps. I guess I was focusing on killing someone. Beyond this little gap that you can see, which I think I'm not. I'm going to do less because it doesn't actually work out very well. Uh, someone at stairs there. Do I get the kill, or do I kill someone else? Oh my god. Okay. See, as you that as you saw there, the first person who started shooting me, I took him out first, and then went for the other one later. Luckily, survived with 10 health. So I'm not going to judge myself on that. I think that was a pretty good decision to make. But I think my biggest improvement so far, looking at this, uh, is my aim. I did want to look at a game where I had as much kills as I did deaths. So, you know, if it's a game where I have more kills and deaths and I and I top frag and it's a great game, uh, then it's a bit, it's, it's not a great analysis because I did great that game, so there's nothing really to analyse. Uh, there was alright, a good a good spray control. I think my favourite gun, of course, I think like most people, was the AK. Oh, yeah, so my accuracy is okay with the AK. So I think I need to do maybe a bit more training on the M4A1S. I feel less confident on it. I don't know why. COD, <laughs> I blame COD for this because I played COD religiously and it kind of led me to believe that the silencer does do something different. It, it does uh, decrease the power and the range. I'm not sure if that is the case in this because uh, I know you could take it off, the silencer off, and it becomes way less accurate. That was a bot taking over. Okay, no, it wasn't a bot. It was taken over by someone killed by not. There's nothing I could do there. Maybe I shouldn't have poked out the window. You know, maybe I should have just gone through, uh, gone through the outside. Gone down to van and then have a little look around. I think just poking my head, just trying to jump out the window was not a smart idea. Um, so yeah, so I, 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 going back to the M4A1S, maybe I just need to be a bit more confident in that it is a good gun. 
and just just go for it like I do with the AK. Uh, just I think honestly it's confidence personally. <laughs> I remember here my um, teammates were shouting me saying bloody plant the bomb what are you doing I didn't realize I have the bomb uh, and that's one thing you kind of really like yeah it's kind of basic isn't it you need to know if you've got the bloody bomb oh see what I did there is I looked left kind of thinking okay he might be in the window but in that situation he's either going to come behind you or he's going to come in front of you if I look left I'm looking at a wall and my crosshair is not on him so kind of dumb uh, for me to kind of look at a wall just because I think he's in the other direction, you know, I, if I did think that I should have just moved back So ugh, what, what can you do though? So down here with the mp7 this guy this, like I can't <laughs> what was he doing? <laughs> what the hell was he doing? He did give me a he did give me my my elite build back <laughs> He took my elite build for crazy out loud. I don't know what he's doing. Was he inspecting it? I don't know. Why would you inspect an elite build? It's not not a big deal, but I, I don't know. I'm not gonna judge. I got the kill. I was happy about that. Uh, and what's the scoreboard right now? So, scoreboard. Alright, there's one more kill there. I, did I shoot my. Did I kill my teammate? No, I didn't. I think I shot him. Uh, but there's nothing I could do there. I am walled off, so 20 to 16 right now. So, all is well. All is well. Yep, getting all the kills where they need to be. Okay. I think I should have reacted a little quicker. I did turn around. And it was a situation where you, you know, you're more likely to come out on the worst side because he shot you first. He's got his aim sorted. He's seen you first. But I think I kind of swiveled a bit before I actually just decided to shoot, which is a bit weird. But I think I just need to, uh, to be more aware of everything, react a lot quicker. There's a guy in jungle there. Take him out. Lovely. I, I, I love the AK. It's such a good gun. <laughs> anyway, um, should have picked up that op, actually. I like the op as well. Anyway, I'm just sidetracking quite a lot here. Yeah, I need to kind of fix. Again, Like it's like sensitivity. Look, look at this accuracy. Look at that. That is just straight luck. I was trying to burst, trying to do some taps maybe. I thought, fuck it. Let's just spray. I'm not. It's not working out. Let's just spray and hope. And it works. So in that one, I guess I just, again, it's probably a sensitivity issue with me. Every time I turn, it it goes all the way across, you know, uh, because they're at some distance and my sensitivity is so high. So I think it's got to turn down my sensitivity, stop the mouse acceleration to stop it from flying. Like when I turn, when I use my mouse and turn because it, it accelerates it faster. So turn that down, give me more accuracy, I think. Go for the P90 here. What I like about the P90 is, well, it's benefits. It's it's not cheap, I know, but it's got a high uh, ammo capacity. I think it's got 50. Um, it's got a high rate of fire, and in the head, it takes a few shots to kill him. And basically, up close, you're going to kill anyone. Maybe I should have checked cat instead of straight into the window. It's either I go one way or the other, you know. But I think that's game over. Looking at it, did pretty well. Uh, at the time, I, I, you know, I still don't actually have a rank, which is why you're seeing there, like, I, I need to win four matches because I, I, that's a whole different story. I lost my account, blah, 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 all that stuff. But I think that was good. I honestly think that the way I uh, behaved in that game was good. There's a few hiccups, um, uh, things I need to improve on. And yeah, if there's anything you looked at and you thought uh, I could, you could have done better, if you're someone who's a global elite and you're watching right now, you know, let me know what I could have done better in those situations uh, that I did end up dying or I did kill someone in a lucky way. Let me know. It'd be lovely, uh, absolutely amazing. Lovely, bloody hell, I've never said that word. It'd be amazing to get your feedback in this to see um, what exactly I can do right instead of freaking out or just completely not thinking rationally in these situations so I can become a much better player and just provide much better content for you guys as well on CSGO Professional Amateurs. So uh, thanks for watching this episode, guys. Uh, if you want to see more of this, be sure to click that like button. Uh, it is a brand new series, of course, on CSGO. <laughs> anyway, it's been FCTV HD. Slap that like button in the face if you enjoy. Subscribe for more CSGO videos and other videos like vlogs, uh, tutorials, anything you really want to see. It's probably going to be on this channel. <laughs> okay, so as I said, slap the like button in the face if you enjoy. Subscribe for more and peace. Everybody asked me how I know. I smiled at them and said she told me so. Everybody asked me how I know. I smiled at them and said she told me so. Everybody asked me how I know.